guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 12 of Fruits Basket. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Cody, what the heck did you run in for? Did you do something, Pluto? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hmm? Would that be Momiji and Haru? Oh, bless you. <laughs> Damn it, Tor. If only you didn't look like. Mm-hmm. What well, damn?
Oh, oh my god. <laughs> mm hmm. It looks fine. Hmm. <laughs> All I hear is you cause him up. It's natural. <laughs> now he's gonna he's gonna do something tomorrow, you'll see. Baka? That's Cosmo for you, man. Always making somebody fucking cry.
but <laughs> oh don't worry come on Yes. need to know right now. Wasn't it the conversation? It was the conversation about something. Because they eventually talk, go back to it in the end. Hmm? Aikido, right? Yeah. Kind of figures we would be in this episode. Yeah, because he wants to meet Toru first. It's so weird to see him just out and about because in the original series we didn't see him until like what the last episode. Mm -hmm. oh, no, 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 no. Mm -hmm. This the way he freaking looks, it looks cold. Mm -hmm.
I hate him so much. I hate him, but yet I feel bad for him. No. And I can't talk about why I hate him. Hmm? Like, go to the arcade? <clears throat> yes, please. I don't even want to talk about him anymore. <laughs> That's true. Not this time, though. And Toro's there to suit that thing.
And he's a dick. But there's a reason why, though. But I can't talk about that yet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. See, I know someone's going to be like, well, you know, hate's such a strong word. Like, you shouldn't really say that to Akito. I mean, it, I have different feelings with this dude. I've always disliked slash hated him ever since I've watched the series, but then I've also felt bad for him, specifically because of what happens in the end of the series and what you... We're going to learn more about him. That's the thing, and I can't really talk about that ish because that is, like, it's a big, major spoiler, as big as the other spoiler that I can't really talk about yet until we get there. But they did the scene. Oh my god, I'm so freaking happy that they did it, and it's right. I mean, I don't know like which did it better, the 2001 version or this version, but it was still good, and it still made me laugh. And just, mm, I wasn't expecting Akito to be in this episode, and to just finally have him and Toru officially meet because the first time they quote unquote met was when he was driving away in the car. So I really wouldn't consider that a me. I would just consider that like a glance. But to have those two see each other and talk to each other, and then Yuki comes and does that to Yuki and makes them remember that stuff. I don't even want to talk about that. But I am currently reading the manga where a lot of people told me to continue by. I'm just like, I'm taking my time with it because I've read like a two, three pages of the chapter. I want to read a little bit more today try to go a little bit more farther and just see what the heck is gonna happen next how have you been my life wait 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 wait, wait. is what's face coming um aya he, he has to be coming next week oh my god please please it has to be i swear to god like come on it's like i technically in a way i think we're what's up cody jesus um we're technically gonna i think maybe either next week or episode 14 we should probably be getting a new opening for this show. Because since this show has like 63 episodes, um, I think they're going to have like several openings. Come here. Um, I got you. You okay? Um, it's going to have several openings and such. So I am hoping that something, we get a new opening. I mean, as much as I love this one, you know, you kind of just want something to change. But yeah, I mean, Akito, he's... Uh, he's he's not a bad guy he's just different that's what I'll say and and I've even said it when I watched the 2001 version he's different and mysterious more mysterious than Yuki was when you first watched Ruth's Basket the first time um it's just when you finally get to learn more about him I, I had nothing but hatred in my heart for him, but then when we got to that very last episode of the 2001 version, I still felt hatred, but then I also felt sadness because of certain reasons. But I mean, yeah, we ain't gonna, like I said, we're not gonna get there until I can't even say honestly because the way that they're doing this, they're not like it, it's completely different because how I don't even remember what episode like this moment was, um, with the you know the hot to horror moment in this episode wherever that was. I know it was in the second half of the 2001 version and we're only on episode 12, about to be on 13 by next week and we're getting into parts that were in the second which is really, it's weird though, but I'm okay with it. I'm like completely okay and that's why a lot of people are like oh no, they wanted the um, the author wanted this series to be a lot more closer to the manga rather than the 2001 version because there was a lot of filler. And I'm still glad that the fact is that there isn't a lot of filler in this, that they're doing the story correctly. And it's just making me, like I said, want to know what the heck is going to happen next. And that's why I was like, you know what, ultimately, I was like, screw it. Let me go ahead and read the dang manga and see, because I know everything up until that point. I just want to know what's happening after. 
and maybe by the time we get there, I may or may not remember, because you never know how long it's going to take for us to get there. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to be towards episode 12 of 2019's Fruits Basket. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Mattress Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys all officially next Friday for episode 13. Bye, guys.